Hey, what's up, Team Infinite? This is uh, Coach Lou, and, you know, I wanted to share with you guys some Thursday tips, and, you know, this is something we had posted in the past, but I thought this time I would make a little video about it, but before I go into those tips, I want to give you guys kind of like a, a prequel tip, and that is, if you're struggling for time with coaching, you can really take advantage of technology to make things easier for yourself. Um, right off the bat, just to use myself as an example, you know, I work very hard in an architecture firm, and one of my jobs is to babysit the other employees who sometimes don't seem to know what they're doing, and I have to correct their mistakes and so on. This causes me to stay late many times. But I noticed um, that there are things on Facebook that I can use to my advantage to help me. For example, I now use the microphone option when I use Facebook on a desktop because I can now leave messages for people that are bullet for bullet real fast and simple and I don't have to type anything up. But the best part of it is it actually creates more excitement because people can hear the level and the intensity of my voice of how um, grateful I am for having them in my team, how excited I am. It kind of motivates them even if I was speaking another language. And also the fact that I'm making this video. When am I making this video? While I'm driving to work. If you have a job that you have to go to, if you have to sit in a car, even if you have to sit on a train, this is a great way to take advantage of technology and be able to just do something where you can reach out to your team and your coaches as well, and even your upline. So these Thursday tips, I want to just piggyback a video that I made for Jennifer earlier in the week. She had a question about how to find people. I went on, I went on and on and on to tell her about using her personal page as a venue for getting people all excited as she starts to friend new people. So moving right along, one really super thing you can do on a Thursday to attract a ton of people is to create a free clean eating group that would start on Monday of the following week. The reason why Thursday is good is because you'll get a lot of people replying. You'll get people that want to join this and they don't have to do anything. They don't even have to make you their coach. This is a great way for people to get feelers, um, for you to send out feelers so that people can see if you're worth it, if you're the real deal, if you're someone that really cares. I remember when I was um, looking at bands for when I got married, I went to this, um, this venue where you could listen to the bands play for an hour to see if you kind of liked them. And then if you did, you could hire that band for your wedding. It's just like that. A free clean eating group is a great way to kind of calm people down. There's no commitment. There's nothing that they have to sign up for. All they need to do is buy their own groceries that they're going to buy anyway. So you're probably wondering, how do I make this clean, free clean eating group? In a little bit, I'll post a link to a PDF that we have that was created by another Diamond Coach coordinating with Chris Bomber. It's a great walkthrough on how to create a clean eating group. There are some scripts with how to approach people, what to post on your wall. And if any of that seems Greek, you can always reach out to me or post in this group what you think you'd like to say, and we can talk about it that way. But when you get people joining this free clean eating group, the reason why Thursday is so important is because you want to give them enough time to prepare their menu. The free clean eating group is going to give them a grocery list and other options. They'll be able to use the weekend to shop for food. And I personally like to try and coordinate a free clean eating group with whatever holiday is coming around the band or just ended. You could you could kind of make this like a uh, you know a post Valentine's Day clean eating group or a you know start spring with a bing free clean eating group that sort of a thing. And it's a great way to have fun. And what's really cool too is if for some reason you're not comfortable with a free clean eating group, you can do a free drink your water group. Uh, there are some coaches that have done that, where everybody is in a group just to make sure that they're drinking enough water, that they're consuming all the water they need, blah, 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 and it works great. So you have people in this clean eating group. It'll run from Monday to Friday, or if you want, from Monday to Wednesday. If you want to cut it down to three days, that's okay. And what's going to happen is you're going to have a private group that you will now have people in, and maybe they have another coach, maybe they... Maybe they're, they don't, but the point is, you're there to help them. You're not there to sell them anything. You're not there to, like, break them into your side, if you will. But you are there to give them motivation and to create excitement 
and to give them tips when they start asking questions like, well, I don't like avocado. Is there something else I can use? You're going to say, yes, yes, you can use mango. Or I don't like cottage cheese. Is there something else I can use? Why, absolutely. Try a little yogurt or try some crumbled tofu. You get the general idea. And a lot of these questions will end up being the same question. But the point being, people are going to see that you're helping them, that you're giving them attention. Plus, they're probably going to lose a couple of pounds during the five days. So when those five or three days are over, you can then have a big hoo congratulations to everyone in the group. You can message each person and you can say, you know, I'm really proud of you. I think you did an amazing job. Have you considered joining my group such and such? Or have you ever heard of the resistance? That's what I would say. And they'll be like, no, what's that? And I'm going to say, well, that's actually my workout accountability group. You did such a great job in our clean eating group. Why don't you come along for that? And I'm telling you, they're going to say yes. If they have another coach, you're really not looking to make someone switch against their will. But if they don't, they're going to feel so comfortable with the fact that you helped them for a few days. There's no reason in the world that they wouldn't sign up under you just to create a free account. And here's the kicker. When someone trusts you, when you're investing this little bit of time with people, when you're using technology to your side, like I mentioned with a microphone, which is kind of like the equivalent of calling and leaving someone a voice message, if you're just sharing some tips, if you're giving people answers personal to their situation, that means you care about them. And caring is a nice thing. And here's what's going to happen. These people are going to trust you. They're going to eventually want to order such and such because they're going to see this person doing turbo fire or that person doing core de force or that person doing body beef. They're going to come to you. Coach Jen, how do I order it? What do I do so you get credit? And that's the best feeling in the world. You didn't have to do anything. You didn't have to try to sell a thing. The product spoke for itself. You, on the other hand, were just sharing your results. You were sharing your personality. All you had to sell was yourself, meaning that you sold your great personality and the fact that you care. There's a great saying, guys. People don't care what you know until they know that you care. And it's so true. So, guys, this is a great Thursday tip. Do everything you can to make this clean eating group start this week. If you think you're not sure about what to do, you can team up together and run one together. I know Julie Stumbo likes to run them with other coaches. Just an example. You and one or two other, three other other coaches could run one together and you can help support each other. And then, God forbid, one of you doesn't have time to answer all the questions. There's always another coach in the group to fill in the details. It's, it's a no-brainer. You can't lose. Plus, it's going to help you get people into your team. And if you're really driven by the fact that you want to make this business work, eventually, within due time, people will start to order things. They'll want to become coaches. And there's nothing wrong with that because it's just the nature of this business. We represent a really incredible line of products that keep people alive. And they're not drugs, which is the cool part. You, you really need to step up to understanding this opportunity. So I digress. That's the tip for today. And I hope you guys have a great one. And I think I'm going to tag some of you to make sure you saw this video.